Hello, today on Random Help, I'm going to be talking about hate. Hate is incorporated throughout society due to many reasons, and I'm not going to be talking about the hate as in prejudice and racism and, um, and sexual orientation kind of hate, because that type of hate it really is up to you to stand strong and go against them it, it's just not right but i'm going to talk about the hate where you've done something wrong and they hate you for that or you've approached someone in the wrong manner and now they hate you because of that so one of the first tips i'll give if you i'm already hated by most of the school anyway but how do you make the hate be from pretty high to a lower amount of hate, let's just say. Firstly, I'd say go and talk to them about what you did wrong. Say, so for me, I voted against the school because I was being stupid, and I did. But I spoke to them and said, "What? I did something wrong. I'm sorry about that. And do you want me to do anything about it? Like I could help you out with something, or buy you something if you want." And they told me, "Yeah." Uh, and then we discussed and we just negotiated and now we're much better as in like we speak to each other more and so there's not this kind of hate kind of atmosphere around also I'd recommend you speak to them as well like I know they don't want to speak to you but after you have been forgiving and stuff then Try to speak to them, like say good morning to them or hi to them from time to time. Just show that you're not being like you're just you're not being rude to them or anything. Like show that you are still a good person, and that's something you have to show. Also, I'd recommend you not think too much of it. If someone hates you and keeps on hating you, and they'll persist, and it doesn't matter what you do, but they'll keep on hating you. Then I'd advise you just forget them, right? Just if they are affecting your lives, then it and like they're making your lives worse, then tell a teacher or something. Most people don't, but at least have a friend to back you up. At least have someone to back you up. But don't always feel like you have to be alone with it, because then that creates a problem where you're trying to do everything on yourself. And it doesn't really work out to do well. Also, I would recommend um, you f- find people, you find interest in these haters. Like then you might be saying, "Oh yeah, we hate each other," but hey, look, we have these. And don't be very like if they ever want to be kind to you, don't ever like go, "No, nah, don't be kind because you hate on me." But just accept they hate on you, but they're trying to be kind to you. And I think these are the few steps you can take to make yourself less hateable. I did things that are really stupid and I've been hated upon and I've broken up on a great friendship I had because of my stupidity. And I just don't want you guys to do the same thing. So always try to know your place in the a relationship you are with them even if it's a hate relationship know your place and do something about it don't just let it go on and then you know because even in hate they still know you're there and they will try to make your life worse but try to make use that hate again against them so they hate you but you show that you don't really care about your hate and you're willing to just forget it and just be friends because that just makes it much better and it will help you out in the long term because why do you need enemies you don't want enemies in your life you want friends you want people to know you're a good person not an enemy and that's why i want you to take away from today all right thank you for watching today uh this is random help and i'll see you next time